One of the powerful ways to use components is to take the geometry from one and copy it to another. Here on my table, I have tenons on the aprons, but I don't have any mortises in the leg. I can make a copy of the leg and both the aprons, move those out into empty space where I have some room to work. I'll spin around, right click, and select Explode from the menu. That turns all of this geometry back into individual lines and faces. I'll erase what I don't need from the aprons, including these small lines that define the edges of the board. When those are gone, what remains were the tenons, and I'm about to make them into the mortises. Now that the leg is how I want it, I'll select the geometry, I'll right click, and I'll click Make Component again. I'll give it the same name that it had, click Create, and this box pops up letting me know it already exists and do I want to replace it. I click Yes, and it's now a component again. When I go back to the other components in the model, all of my legs now have mortises.